Well, hello everyone, and welcome back to me, myself, and I playing this here game. Uh, wow. Okay. <laughs> I thought I'd have a look at the leaderboards to see how people are doing, but... Uh, I'm guessing it's a difficult one. We're doing Eden as far as that looks like the dark room. Some people have done really well. Well, let's see how we do. It shall be as it is. Hmm. Uh, we start with Bob's Brain and Scorpio. Uh, which is going to help us get some cash. To start with. Uh, no trinket. Quite slow. Very slow rate of fire. But at least we've got poison damage, I suppose, to help us out. Maybe we only need to hit everything once. <laughs> right. Wow, this is going to be a, a slow run. Obviously, we're going as far as we're going, which means... Uh, let's harp on about the hush fight again, shall we? Oh god, we've got to do hush to be even remotely likely to contend. That's going to be dull. If we can't get a decent amount of damage, I'll be surprised if we even make it that far, to be honest. Now, lots of people have made it that far, which gives me some encouragement. Ah, uh, thank you for dying. There's a certain chance that that after us... Ooh, I quite like lost contact, actually. I'm not going to re-roll really that. There's a certain chance that maybe we have to survive a certain distance before it gets good. Um, it happens a lot, especially on Judas runs. Judas is sort of predisposed towards it. If you die on the first floor, which is very likely with 1 HP, uh, which we have, by the way. <laughs> I hadn't even considered that. We are basically doing a Judas run right now. So let's just not die. That's going to be plan A. Maybe get some spirit hearts from somewhere. God knows where. Here you go. Have a bomb in your face. This is going to be uh, difficult to improve on, but I think once we get past a certain point during this run, we're going to find our tiers are upgraded, the damage is good, going to have a good DPS, good survivability, and that's what we're really going to be hoping for. So something decent from this boss, uh, if we can finish it before the end of this year. It's going to be super helpful towards that, and I'm going to try not to get hit, because we only have 1 HP and we didn't find any Sinted Rocks. Or even any uh, any random spirit hearts, nothing. We could go into the shop if we could find a key, but we obviously didn't find a key, otherwise we would have gone to the shop. Probably don't need to uh, mention that. Uh, yes, excellent. Alright, that's a good start. We could look for the secret room now, I think about it. We had one bomb left. I think the bomb was probably better spent on that boss. So we've got some decent damage now. So we've got that going for us. Uh, put that on your dating profiles. We have good damage. Long walks in parks. Capable of crying heavily on things. I suppose that's a... Uh, it shows an emotional side. Oh, shit. Wow, I would not be surprised if the majority of people who played this game died there. Oh, excuse me. Can you get your tears out of my way? Thank you. Tempted to use our bomb to maybe find a secret room now. Uh, our Bob's Rotten Head, I mean. Because if it's here... Ta-da! It's not. We could have got into the... The shop down there. Which I may still do, but I'd rather find the item room first. Should we fight our boss? Good question. Thank you for asking. Ah, no. Let's explore the floor. We want to get to the shop, and we want to get to the item room, and we want to take this. I would very much like to have Box of Friends, mind you. Although we don't have any friends. <laughs> you know, speak for yourself. I suppose. We'll do that afterwards, just in case. If we're going to fight one boss and be scared about our HP, then we should be scared about our HP fighting two bosses. Uh, pardon me? So that thing was protected from the explosion. We've got a bomb back. Oh, this is bullshit. Where is my good stuff? Where's my reroll? The reroll? In that situation, huh? That's where I want my reroll. Pop this here. Thank you very much indeed. Well, this has taken us a little longer than anticipated, but, you know, work it out. We've got to get to Boss Rush in 20 minutes. There are eight floors. You know, two sets of two. That gives us two minutes per floor with four minutes in between. Four minutes spare, if you will. Uh, this is a pin fight, which is super easy. That means if we're out of this floor by four minutes, which we will approximately be... We'll be about on target. Uh, obviously, the floors are getting longer. And we did get our deal and a decent damage upgrade, so that's good too. Uh, I'm probably going to take the nail right now. If it's all the same to you. 
Bob's rotten head has been helpful, but not helpful enough. Ah, uh, of course I stepped on the spike, so now I'm going to die anyway. Uh, we'll use it on the next floor whenever we feel scared. Not doing the boss trap room, that probably would be the death of me. It's gonna, it's costly not to do the boss trap room. Uh, obviously we need to do it to contend, because there's points in there. And what do points mean? Right. That was a lucky guess. Uh, but I don't want to do it if it's going to mean that we don't contend at all, because we're dead. Which I think is fair. I think you'll, you know, grant me that benefit of the doubt on that one. Uh, at some point we will use this nail charge. I will use it here, because um, I'd like to get rid of these rocks, <laughs> mostly. They're in my way. Also, it gives us a spirit heart, and these things are audaciously likely to hit me, even though I don't want them to. Uh, okay, perfect. Now we've got three spirit hearts. We're happy. So the nail is going to ensure survivability in two fashions. First of all, uh, the fact that it gives us a spirit heart every time we use it. Secondly, it gives us damage upgrade every single time we use it. So it's going to make the rooms we use it on easier to beat and uh, easier to survive if we have trouble beating it. So kind of win-win. That was just shit. <laughs> Thank you, me, for paying so much goddamn attention. Uh, probably use it here. I'm very scared of stepping on these mushrooms now, but there is Tinter Drop, which I hadn't spotted until after I'd used the nail. I'm going to pretend that I've seen it all along, and that was my master plan. Uh, should we take the pill? Yes. Balls of steel. Wow. All right, good. We have come away from this shining, smelling like roses in a rose bush. No fertilizer or manure. Anywhere to be, well, smelled, I suppose. We are... Supremely survivable. I would very much like a tears upgrade, a rate of fire upgrade, but I can't really complain. Considering how far we've come, let's think about it in nose terms. We started off with the same basic rate of fire, but if this thing would fucking get out, we would die. Ah! There. Just a little bit of poison damage sorts it all out. Good. Oh, great. Well done. These neutral flies. Seven something. Double charge. Well, that's pretty good as well. It means next time we use the nail, we will use it twice. At the same time, it's free. A free double charge on the nail. I'm just going to explode this. I'm not too fussy. Uh, kind of slower than I'd like. We need to speed up to get to boss rush. We need to do boss rush because uh, it's a daily. Hello. How have you been? Uh, I think we're doing okay. I don't remember off the top of my head what Jekry's and... Uh, and Viva's score were, but I have a feeling we can get somewhere reasonably close to that. Hopefully we can uh, get beyond it and, you know, taunt them. Ah, excuse me, no. Remember that bit where I was dodging well? You know, doing a hush fight without getting hit? Yeah, where were those days, man? Good times. Those days are gone. We get Roid Rage. That's a speed and range upgrade. Uh, we need to actually go to this. Why didn't I go to the item room all those years ago? Oh uh, yeah, good question. So now we're on eight minutes on the third floor. So we're going too slowly. But I didn't go to the item room when I feel foolish and I wasn't paying attention. And so see me, what are you going to do? I will also go to the cursed room while I'm here, just in case. Forget not that we do get two spirit hearts as soon as we use our nail. Take some damage penalty for that. Virgo. Cool. Well, now all our pills are not going to hurt. We don't know what they are. That's PhD. But we can have some idea that they're not going to be... They're not going to be downgrades. Although they could still hurt in some... Some other sense, such as they could give us a curse or they could just suck. I think amnesia... I don't think amnesia is one of the pills, but there are some pills that still count as good pills, even though... Uh, they clearly are not good in any respect. Right, let's try and go a little bit faster. I'd like to get um, I'd like to get some way of doing that more reliably. This going faster thing. I don't know whether we get the benefit of two damage upgrades from uh, from a double charge on the nail. That was probably not a good idea, considering we only had two keys. But it is what it is. Uh, yeah, just get stuck in the corner there. Why don't you? It's going to slow us down a lot as well, but. Chubb can eat a bomb. Chubb hates smoke. I don't think you knew that. Wow. So, yeah, you can see why we're really gunning for a tears upgrade at this stage of the game. 
any tiers upgraded at all, although I'd very much like something like Torn Photo. Uh, the coat hanger, that sort of thing. And there's a second boss, which is fucking peep of all things. So we're going to be here all day. When it jumps, put a bomb down. Oh, we can uh, keep shooting, of course. It will use up one of our tiers to get rid of one of its shots, but that's fine. Boom. Good. Boom. Good. Boom. This is probably the most sensible way of dealing with peep, because it just goes away faster. Oh, close. Good dodging. Not taking too much stupid damage so far, although we're going extremely slowly, which is a problem. Uh, these might turn into bonies, so we've got to be careful with that. I don't think they remain poisoned when they become bonies as well, so... Please. Any sort of tears upgrade is going to be such an upgrade for us. Such a benefit for us. Obviously, it's going to be an upgrade, because it's an upgrade. It's in the name. Pay attention. But it's going to be hugely beneficial to have a tears upgrade at this stage. Uh, although, I'm not sure... I don't think there's a way of swinging it. We're just going to have to hope. Maybe a pill will give it to us. Wow, so many of these as well. No nail charge to help out. We've just got to take our time. I'm strongly starting to suspect that boss rush may not be an option simply because we're shooting so slowly. Uh, key helps. It's not like I missed a huge number of those uh, shots just now. Two hearts has no benefit for us. It's just that, you know, each, <laughs> each shot didn't count for too much. And there's so few of them. Uh, we might as well do this, right? Yeah, we might as well. I'm not going back for the rest of it, but uh, okay. <laughs> Spend it straight away. Whatever. Here's our boss. Do we want to go to the boss? No, although that could be good. Wheel of Fortune, not really. Not enough money to play the Wheel of Fortune and not enough benefit from doing so. It's not enough... Not enough potential in the Wheel of Fortune. So I will not be taking the, that option. That thing exploded from poison damage, but we do have Virgo invincibility, so we can get in close to these things and make sure we don't miss any of our shots. And maybe this thing will die away from me. Thank you. This is where we want to be. This is exactly where we want to be. Uh, let's put a bomb here and maybe try and take out an enemy with it. Did not work. Worth a try, worth a try. Some more spirit hearts are valuable. That didn't work either. This room, actually, to be honest, it helps to just clear the playing field a little bit. Ah, that's no use. Don't want that. What a waste of a key. We'll see if there's something in here we can get for five cents. Uh, no. And I'm... Maybe the pill. What's the pill? Tears up. Are you a wizard? Well, that's one of the ones that sucks, but doesn't get removed by Virgo. We'll leave this floor without worrying about the bonus for exploration. We want to get the bonus for doing boss rush. That's a lot more important. Uh, two of hearts is nothing. At least Wheel of Fortune can give us some benefit from a bomb at some point in the future. And also at some point in the future, maybe Wheel of Fortune, uh, maybe Are Your Wizard will wear off and we can start doing some damage to the enemies. Uh, help. Oh, there we go. Good. Phew. No. Don't let Gertie hit you. You've done that enough times in recent videos. For people to be expecting that. It's very embarrassing when you let Gertie do damage to you from those sideways shots where all you need to do is step out of the way. It's just like that. Well done. Please reset these nubs so I don't have to deal with them. Jesus, our damage. You can see how bad our damage is just based on the fact that Gertie is taking this long to die. Uh, let's just uh, let's talk about the weather. How's it been in your... Oh. There you go, you see? Told you. So how's the weather been around your area? It's been a uh, it's snowed recently here. Thanks for asking. Uh it's been frosty. I think my strawberries are probably dead. I haven't covered up my strawberries with fleece like I was going to. <sighs> the day it snowed was the day that I was thinking of going to the garden centre to ship me to buy some fleece. Let's just put a bomb in there. Go fuck yourself, Gertie. Hooray! I <laughs> gave up not taking damage. There is our torn photo, exactly what I asked for. Right, speed up. Thirteen minutes on this stage of the game is not fast enough to do boss rush because we've got we've got longer rooms ahead of us, longer floors, harder enemies, oh, tears upgrade, you can feel it, it's palpable, it's delectable, it's helping. Man, fucking love, uh, I love me some shielded tears, 
But they can they can really screw you over sometimes. If you accidentally shoot a bomb out of the sky just before it hits you, you're gonna have a bad time. We can uh, poison damage these and not worry about it. Yeah, die. Good. Let's get in here. It's a mob trap room, so we should be okay. That spider dealt with those for us, which I'm super happy with. Uh, that thing jumped on me because I wasn't paying attention. Because there's three things on the screen and I can only pay attention to one thing at once. Look, I pay attention to a lot of stuff at work. I can see forever. That's actually a really good pill. We should probably use this. I'm starting to feel like maybe the uh, car battery is going to make our nail that much less efficient. Uh, over time, anyway. Because it's going to give us two spirit hearts per charge. That's two spirit hearts per six rooms. Which is... Three spirit hearts, uh, two spirit, one spirit heart per three rooms. There you go. Maths is in my head somewhere. Temperance. Uh, you know what? We'll put this and this, and then we'll do this. Probably could have used a uh, like a bomb that was going to be otherwise useful. Ooh. No, we're going all the way anyway, so don't need to do that. Power pill. That was a power pill. Uh, so one spirit heart every three rooms just means we can get hit twice every three rooms and. You know, stay, keep maintain parity, uh, which is some posh words that mean not lose. Plus, we can probably put an explosion here. Chaos card. Wow. Right. Let's get to hush. <laughs> I was just thinking today. Do you remember that time I got chaos card and used on hush? Ah, that was that was a great daily. So we can we can take as much time as we need here. Just don't accidentally press Q. And these fucking bonies. You have to shoot faster than them. Uh, I do want the key. Although I'd spent the key to get in here, so I guess maybe I shouldn't have bothered. Uh, okay. I've accidentally in the past pressed Q thinking I was pressing tab. Or whilst pressing tab, fat fingered tab key. If I use the chaos card by accident, I am going to be super salty with myself. So get ready for that. It's going to be a fun time for all. Scapula? I mean, is it going to help? It's a good item. But you have to imagine that with the nail having a double charge, we're not going to get down to the level of HP required for Scapula to give us one back. So Scapula will give us an HP back whenever we get down to half a heart on a room, but only once per room. So if we hurt ourselves on a room, the only time I think it would be worthwhile would be if said room were self-sacrifice room. We don't need to do that because we can get to that part of the game anyway. Because that's how far we're going. I'll use the nail here. It is a damage upgrade as well. Plus stompy, but there's no rocks. Never mind the rocks. This is a sort of enemy that you don't want to trifle with too much with shielded tears. Because those bombs can uh, do you a bit of damage. Be careful of that. Do care for this. Can I have the baddie please? Where are you? Hello? There you are. Good, good, good. Uh, a sack. Don't mind a sack. That contains another nail charge, which can immediately give us most of what we just spent back. Let's move on. We've got the next floor to do and three minutes to do it. <laughs> I'm scared. Right. Just press on. Don't let them grind you down. We will save our nail charge for a large room, I think. Mind you, there's a strong chance that the large room is between us and the boss, so we should do it. Uh, I got hit, but it didn't seem to hurt. Or it just didn't make a noise, maybe. Still, I really hate these leapers. Can you guess why? It's because they teleport across the goddamn room. Uh, room? Yes. The lovers, chaos... I think we'll stick with chaos card. I was hoping maybe for a black heart or two, but whatever. I am succeeding at these rooms, which is unheard of. We are basically one-shotting those, which is unheard of. There's no point going to the shop, we have two cents. I was wrong about where the boss might be. I can't stompy <laughs> at this stage. That's fine. Just shoot faster than a bony and you're sorted. Pick up the scent for no reason. Well, points, I guess. Two minutes. Coming up to two minutes. And we still have to beat Mom in that time as well, and we're not doing the hugest DPSs of all. Well, I did say boss rush was unlikely, just based on our DPS. You know, it was very... Hmm. It wasn't helping us, let's be honest. 
I mean, we could Chaos Card Mom, but why would I do that? There's a Hush fight coming up. Okay. We'll find the item room. We know where the Mum fight is. The Mum fight? The Mom fight. This is American, after all. Let's uh, respect the way the words are spelled. I think we've beaten... Uh, <clears throat> I think we've beaten the others. I'd be interested to see where they died, or to learn where they died. Uh, but hopefully they will watch this and rejoice at my amazing Isaac skills. These things again! Man. Not taking damage on those rooms is outrageous. <laughs> no, no, let's just fuck off! Right, we're gonna, uh, we're gonna bail. It'd be nice to know where the item room is, but this floor has decided to fuck me, so fuck it, I suppose. It's not a teleport card, is it? Strength lovers, no. If that was a teleport card, I'd have a much stronger chance of coming back and finding the item room, but it was not to be. It's a stompy of these. I wish I had an orbital right now. It's much easier to beat Mom when, uh, when you have an orbital, because the foot comes down. It doesn't do contact damage, so you walk into it with your orbital. I think we can probably manage this. Let's uh, try and hit everything that sticks out. If it sticks out, I'm gonna chop it off. It's like when uh, when your mum hoovers your room when you're a kid. If it's on the floor, it's getting hoovered. Up. Come on, come on. 20 seconds. Just do the poison damage to everything. It's fine. If we can maybe even tempt the hands out. Ah, we can do it, we can do it. Can we do it? We can nearly do it. Come on, five seconds. <gasps> Right, breathe. We are actually going to Blue Baby, not the other one. Probably don't need the Relic. Ouija board could be good. I think I know what I want. And we will be able to get a... Uh, we will be able to get a Nail Charge or several during this. Apparently there are 15. Uh, that was very, very clever. Well done. Um, 15 waves of Bosphorus. So this is one. Wave one. We can tap shoot. Hope you don't mind keyboard noises. Careful there. We seem to have Virgo invincibility. You can tell because it's lasting forever. Uh, Bosphorus could take a while. <laughs> I mean, we need to get out of it in time to do Hush. There's no point having a Chaos card for Hush if you can't actually get to Hush. But I think it should speed up once we've used the nail. Don't forget it's the double charge on the nail as well. Man, monster, just deal damage to everything on the room. There you go. The Revenge of the monster. Apparently it's a, post a posthumous monster. Means it's dead. Good. Nail charge coming up. I don't know whether it's better to charge this up and fire big shots, or tap shoot small shots. I'm going to sort of uh, average it out. There we go. <laughs> of course. <laughs> Tap shooting small shots is actually really good against enemies like this because you get a lot of shots on the screen, all of which burst a tear. You don't need to do a specific amount of damage to burst a tear. You just, you know, hit it and it pops. So your lower powered uh, small tears that you can shoot really fast, fast you can press the button. What else have we got? Uh, can be used to get rid of all those, uh, those pesky bullet hells. However, the time that's the most of the problem is Hush. What are we not doing today? Hush. What do we say to the Angel of Hush? Not today. Wow, what are you doing here? Wheel of Fortune. That's actually handy. I'm going to hold on to this because then I won't accidentally press Q and use the, <laughs> use the Chaos Guard on Boss Rush. Where's the war gone? There you are. Come back. You need to uh, stop disappearing so I can actually take take you out. Come on, chat. I know what you're doing. It's not working. So the nail will at least keep us in HP. And it would have been great to have a reroll, I suppose. I'm not sure chocolate milk was the right choice of the options. I think it was. But, you know, would I have chosen it if I could have rerolled? Probably not. I probably would have gone for the reroll. What have we got here? Uh... You are probably my highest priority. Congratulations. You've made the cut. 
And now you're my highest priority because you're in my goddamn way. Nope. Careful. We did take damage, uh, but that's okay. Because now we have invincibility, which I'm going to use to get close to these things. Man, an orbital would be tremendous. Not sure whether that was a uh, charge shot that was super big, <laughs> or whether I'm doing even more damage. However, we're going mildly quicker than we were, so there's that. I uh, lost count. Has anyone else... Uh, has anyone been counting? Uh, I know we're supposed to be doing 15 waves, but... Uh, apparently I wasn't paying attention, so now I don't know where we are. Probably at 6 or 7? 6 or 7? Do you know, there was a time... When I started playing Isaac, I used the controller. I used the Xbox controller. In fact, I explicitly bought... Uh, deficit. I explicitly bought one of those... Um, I can't remember what it's called. You know, that lets you use your Xbox controller on your PC. Just so that I could play Isaac with the controller. Play it with the um, keyboard now. But the nice thing about the Xbox controller, if anything, was that the using of things was on the shoulder buttons that match the position of the things that you're using. These are the cards were on the right, cards and pills were on the right, bombs were on the left. It's the other way around on the keyboard. So when I started using the keyboard, I couldn't figure out, I couldn't get the hang of which button to press. I kept using awesome cards and bombs, uh, cards and uh, pills, instead of placing bombs and vice versa. Well, awesome bombs, maybe not such a, such a real thing. But you know what I'm getting at. And I'm very much afraid I'm going to do it again. It's E for bombs and Q for cards. You can remember this because you keep fucking it up and pressing Q when you've got an awesome card. Because you think you're pressing tab and you ain't. You ain't, sunshine. Where's the other chap? No. Oh, there you are. Do that. Did you get it? Yeah, you did. Ha <laughs> ha! So there's certain tactics to boss rush, e.g. When there's a wave like this on the screen. Let that one kill the rest of them. Come on now, we've only got five minutes to get to Hush. Which we may not actually succeed at. Which upsets me. Hmm. I'm not sure how to do that. It's going to be very difficult to get to Hush. We've done it before, and here's Brownie, of course, pissing everybody off. We've got to Hush in record time before, but more by luck than judgement, I have to say. You know, you can only speedrun it if you know where you're going, and we don't. I'm half tempted to use the fucking Chaos card on that son of a bitch. Doesn't matter too much, we can take as much damage as we like to maybe use the invincibility to our advantage. Yep, there we go. Virgo has got our back now. And tap shoot this. Uh, what was happening there? Apparently I was sliding around for no reason. Are we still doing this? Oh, careful. I mean, we could do very large and slow shots. can't believe Gurdy's involved. We're going to be here all day. Or we could do fast shots. I can't tell which one's actually making the HP go down faster. But at least the small enemies, there's no point wasting our entire shot on that. Maybe we're not going to be doing Hush. I'm surprised we got to Boss Rush, to be honest. Maybe we should not have done Boss Rush and tried to get to Hush, because Hush is worth a lot more. A bit more. More of them! Jesus Christ. I was kind of wrong about the 6th or 7th wave then, I suppose. What are you doing here? What I killed you yesterday. No, you did it, Kobe. That's it. It's not it. Jesus fucking Christ. <laughs> are we there yet, Mum? Jeez Louise. How are you still alive? And you shot me. I wasn't paying attention to you, you bastard. Get out of it. You have a long way to go to get to Hush. It's going to be difficult in the extreme. Where did I get this extra card from, by the way? What bestowed this extra card upon me? More! Jeez, we've already beaten you today. What have we got over here? Just pin. I think that's just pin anyway. Can't really do enough damage. I suppose that's always true. Let's pin. Here you are. Sit! No. Nope. Yeah, you kill him. Is that bloat? I think that's bloat. I don't want to fight bloat. Please. <laughs> I'm just tanking the damage now because we get it back all the time. 
put a bomb down here and push him into it. Here you go. Have another bomb. Here you go. Have another bomb. How many bombs can we manage? All of them? All the bombs in the world? La 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 la. That's it. Please be it. We're not going to get to Hush. We've got a minute and a half. Uh, I don't want that. <laughs> Thank you. Thanks, but no thanks. We'll take the uh, Chaos card anyway because we will beat the shit out of something on the way. Oh, that took forever. I'm going to have a cup of tea. I'm surprised you people haven't. I wouldn't be surprised if you had. I would not blame you. If that was a cup of tea fight, you know, tea sandwich, it's like the advert breaks on a Channel 4 movie. Because, yeah, we still watch movies on TV. We don't mind the adverts. Why do we do it? What's the, what's wrong with us? I don't watch movies on TV because I don't watch anything on TV, but you know what I mean. When you're around at someone's house, it's like, should we put the TV on and watch a film? Well, I've got Netflix, but yeah. I think I like the way that it just takes your uh, decisions away from you. You know, do you want to watch a film? Yeah, what do you want to watch? No fucking idea. There's every film under the sun available to us right now. Which one do you want to watch? Dunno. Or, turn on the TV, do you want to watch this exact specific film or nothing? Well, if we watch nothing, we'll have to talk to each other, so... I guess we'll just watch the film. I guess we open this as well. Not going to... Ooh, that's good. This is unfortunate, because it looks like we would possibly have had the opportunity to get to Hush. You know, had we finished the fight when I was expecting to finish the GD fight. I'm a Gurdy. Don't do the don't do the spikes thing. That's the hard thing. Uh, no, just no. Okay, so what's going to happen here is we're going to take a full heart of damage all the time, but we're going to get two hearts back all the time anyway. Ooh. Ooh. I have to suggest that maybe this is worthwhile. Uh. Even though it's very scary. What do we get from this? Rules card. Rules. Chop to slight smoke. I told you. Didn't I tell you? Oh, I told you, didn't I? I'm going to do one more room. Bear with me. Get a charge on my nail. To help with... Okay. I'm going to do one, room, one more room with actual combat on it. There we go. Get a charge on my nail. Use it. Come back up here. Remember about the spikes. Good job. Get this battery charge. It's not like... Oh, I can't. That's okay. We got a charge on the nail anyway. Which gets some of the HP back that we just wantonly spent. Like, you know, like we're rich on this stuff. Which I guess we are. The the Tammy's head pickup... No, the Cricket's head pickup is probably going to be really good. This should be one-shotting everything now. Especially with a charge shot. Unless the charge shot gets broken. This is the point where the lost contact starts to become... Possibly not as useful as it was when we first got it. Because chocolate milk can do a huge amount of damage to a single enemy. But it only takes one tier to get rid of that entire charge. Which is kind of a waste, obviously. It takes uh, costs us. Well, we're off by hush by maybe a couple of minutes. Which is a shame, because boss rush was just that tanky. And we had that little damage. I don't think there was anything we could have done. We got to boss rush in the first place. The only thing we could have done was foreseen that we couldn't beat boss rush fast enough. And, you know, prioritise the hush thing, I expect. Which makes sense. We did find a chaos card, and if you're going to do anything, just prioritise using the chaos card on hush. It's not like we have to beat Mega Stan or anything. Do do do. Ah, well, we might as well use this here because there's a <laughs> great. <laughs> Immediately lose half fucking HP that I got. It's a good thing we picked up that car battery. That's been super useful. Devil, we don't care too much for. Use it again. Probably should have saved it at least for a room that we can do more damage on as a result. But I have to imagine it's not a huge problem. Oh, thanks. Now I have to wait. La la la, stand around. Oh, and another battery. I don't know why we're getting so many batteries. Flight would have probably been a good thing to pick up, but then we would have batteries that would be recharging our flight item, 
and therefore we wouldn't really want them. Ah, uh, Isaac, you're a harsh mistress. We are definitely one-shotting basically everything that comes along, which is fine with me, although I'm still not a fan of enemies you have to wait for. How did you not get poisoned? Good. Okay, so we're basically five minutes late. Which is fine, because boss rush took five minutes longer than I wanted it to. Uh, I mean, we could just chaos card this now. Fuck it. <laughs> it was boring. Uh, yeah, we might as well go. I mean, we, we could probably do with the uh, exploration bonus from that floor. I could also do with not bothering with that floor. Guppy? We did get at least one guppy item. I don't think we got two. Although Guppy's not going to be super helpful. I wonder whether the, um, the flies scale with the damage that your charge shot is getting ready for. Oh, we can open this while we've got invincibility. That's great. It had shit all in it, but we could. I found pills. That's even better. Not only did we uh, manage to open the, the spiky chest and get fuck all out of it, we also opened the red chests and got fuck all out of them as well. Please. Well, at least we're not doing Hush. <laughs> I was super excited for Hush because we were going to be able to use a Chaos card and get it over with instantly, but no. Game had other ideas. Game. You've done it again. You don't got to be an arsehole about it, game. Should probably get uh, Monstro to break its own baddies. Choo choo choo. I wonder whether uh, the brimstone attack breaks my shots. And done. Still not going super superbly quickly. I have to be honest. Well, I don't have to be honest. I choose to be honest that we're not going as fast as I'd like. like our, our damage is good, but any shot that misses is a shot we have to recharge. I assume these things do contact damage. Uh, hello? Look, that's very dangerous. Okay, have it back. <laughs> Don't have to uh, get a perk or a power up in Isaac to kick bombs around. That's great. Plus, <laughs> stop bombing me. That was my own shot from, you know, Kane's other eye, which has been such a major benefit to this throughout its entire run. Don't know how I would have done it without it, to be honest. Really don't know. What a, a massive benefit to any run. Such a such a boon. La la la, are we there yet? No. How about now? No. Excuse me, no. Stop that. And shoot. Good shot. And when those things aren't shooting at you, you can put your full force of a charge shot into it. Can I be bothered exploring the rest of this floor after this? Somehow we have to actually land shots at this stage, without Isaac's own shots cancelling them out. Good luck with that, I guess. Easier said than done. Watch out, watch out. I think it's fair to say we did a bit better than the others. It's, a, it's my first time that I've had an opportunity to compare my uh, my, uh, my performance against people I actually know. Because he, as previously mentioned, is a Jebend. Do you see that shit, by the way? It just spawned an angel right on top of me, which <laughs> caused me to take damage whilst I was trying to move around and get into a position where it could actually cause damage to Isaac himself. This would have been a good time to have used the uh, Chaos card, but, you know, we had to pick our moment, and we did. I've taken a lot of damage. Um, I guess I could have not, but where's the fun in that? That's going to be my philosophy on this subject. Plus, Isaac, you're taking so long. We keep missing, you see. Because my shots are so big. I'm just getting intercepted by its own. What? 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 No. What? The tricks of these beams of light is to stand in uh, anything but the corner that they're going to. Any corner but that one. So... Don't stand in the top corner, because they're going to start in one of those two. A good way of getting it is to stand in the middle of a corner uh, of a 
short side. And if they start on that side, wow, got hit right at the end there. Not, not good at that. Yeah, if they start on the side that you stood on, move down. If they start on the other side, move up. Uh, money equals power could be okay. Ten bombs is fine. I mean, do I want Book of Shadows for invincibility every three rooms, or do I want extra damage every six? I think I have to stick with what we've got, because Book of Shadows certainly will not benefit from the car battery. Yeah, you kill that. It's super nice having Brimstone enemies when there's other enemies to, ow, to die from it. Items. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> okay. These things, of course, will break as soon as I hit a tier, but that's okay. Wow. <laughs> well, I'm glad I came this far. Um, unfortunately, we couldn't do it. Hush. Well, I guess that happens. Excuse me. How many shots are you really taking? And a useless item. Essentially. Didn't one shot that. What? Considering the size of these tiers, you'd think that Mega Maul would have lasted a lot less time. I don't even know what that one broke on. And I don't know how I caught that shot. Okie dokie then. Let's uh, use this, see how much better we're doing. If either of these bullshit familiars would like to do some amount of damage, that would be swell. I don't really... Uh, I think I had much control over what I killed last on this room. Normally you maybe want to try and kill Lust last. Uh, because Lust... Ow. I actually kind of thought that I was going to block that shot. Uh, Lust can drop uh, the virus, which is syringe. Small chance of spun. Not the end of the world. I I'm getting hit a lot. I need to stop doing that. There's um, creep on the floor, be careful with that. Let the creep hit you. Well, don't walk on it. I guess it's not a matter of the creep hitting you. There we one shot that son of a bitch. Down and out with the count. War has no chance of survive. Nick of time. Good. One more room and this on it. Oh god, no. Help. Leave me alone. I keep getting hit, but it's not making the noise. It's not going, ah! Not making the flinch noise. I would call it the flinch noise. For it is the noise you make when you flinch. Those shots did a lot of damage. And another spirit heart. Superb. Fast enough? Yes. And this is the boss. I was half expecting it to be. Maybe if I'd said something, I would have looked good by now. But I didn't say something. Uh, screw it. Let's go. Let's just sort this out. Got enough damage that we can do this probably reasonably quickly. If I can land a shot at all, that would be splendid. I guess we just do a tap shooting type thing. So that some of the shots cancel out the blue baby shots and some of the shots actually hit blue baby. Wow, most of my shots are failing to hit right now. Oh, and now he's got flies as well. That's even better. Sure. Why not? Why not both? This shit. Get out of it. Stand in the uh, dead zone there. Good job. Are these people in the background singing Blue Baby? Diablo 2 Blue Baby. Careful there. <laughs> I don't know how I avoided that. We are done here. We will pick up this for the extra points. We'll pick up this because it's the end. How did I do an entire run with only 30,000 points? We are in the top 1,000, which is okay. Uh, but oh, Hush was imperative on that run and we just didn't do it, which is a shame and another 6,000 damage penalty but thank you for watching, if you enjoyed it, let me know if you didn't, let me know why and come back tomorrow or whenever I play thanks for watching, see you then